guys it's red here we're uh, in a new game for the channel here and it's called farming together so i've gone ahead and we are creating a new farm uh i'm trying to think of a good name what should we call it oh. let's call it apple farm just because we can there we go apple farm uh, I've got one previous that I play on myself, that's personal, so I thought I'd create this one for you guys and show you what it's all about. So, essentially, farming together, it's uh, all about farming together in theory. Uh, one second. No, 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 I'm right. Yeah, yeah, I thought I went on the wrong farm then. I'm level 11 and it must keep the level for you, I don't know why. We're starting a new farm anyway. Uh, essentially, it's a multiplayer game. You can join other people's farms. You can do odd jobs for them, stuff like that. Uh, in your options of your farm, you can have people come and do certain things, like they can do the fields or the trees or the animals or nothing at all. Just pop in and see what's going on. So, when you start off, you start off with lettuces and carrots that's the only two main things that you can start off with and as you can see as you progress on you unlock more and more items we have apple trees animals we don't have any fish we don't have any uh, plants we don't have much uh, you can also buy things like a vegetable stand and a well uh, I'll cover that as we go along uh, but mostly these are the diamonds your diamonds you collect uh, by uh, your little stands and stuff like that like I said we'll cover that in future videos but this video is to start off and see what's what so we're gonna go over here now and we're going to water our cabbages is it cabbage lettuces lettuces get that rock and roll in and then we'll uh, we'll wait for them to harvest some things take longer, some things you can't plant in certain seasons. I think the seasons last for... Oh, I'm trying to think now. I think it's seven minutes is a season. I think. I'm not 100% sure on that. But like I said, you can plant certain things in certain seasons. Uh, and... You can uh, you can harvest near enough everything if it's already planted. Hence, if you bought the fields next to it, if it was during halfway through winter season and it was a certain thing that wasn't in season at that time, you can happily go along and harvest it anyway. So that's pretty good, but you won't be able to plant it again. Uh, along the way we have quests we have a lot of quests to do so what I'm going to do is we're going to plow these fields wait for them carrots to do and we'll have a look at what quests are next I'm not sure what the first quest is but we'll find out so if you press the escape it brings you up your inventory of what you've got so I've got like 8 vegetables out of 20 your room's only 20 I think you can upgrade that I'm not too sure but if we go into quest log, this is our first quest, so we have to harvest 30 carrots. I don't know what this times 8 is on about. In the reward we get a little, like, uh, a rosette if you like, and 10 XP. So we need to get onto these carrots, which look like they're nearly done. Yeah, there's about 11 seconds on them. So that's one. We've got to do 30 of these. So we'll, uh, although they're going to take a while, that one should be done. Whilst that's doing, we'll jump in and we'll grab some more carrots. And we'll plant them in here. Might as well get it rock and rolling and looking good. As for the uh, trees, the trees you cert is certain seasons you harvest that in. The apple trees all year round, you can harvest them all year round. I think the lemons, 
are in summertime and I'm not sure about anything else. I've not been planted anything else. So it's it's easy to use. W A S D to move about. Uh, left mouse button to choose what you want. Q's to open your infantry. Uh, escape obviously gets you to quest. So it's really straightforward and it's an actual fun, really fun game to play. I've been playing it, it's been out for a few months now. And I've been playing it on and off for a few months. Especially when it comes to like something that's going to take forever to do. You, you just wait. You just jump off and jump back on as and when needed. It's brilliant. It's like the uh, farm games that you, you used to get on fa Facebook. I don't, I don't know if you played them, but I used to play them a lot. But it's just a lot more, uh, a lot more involvement. <laughs> Come on, hurry up! Six seconds. <laughs> this is the pain of waiting for things. Uh, also, you if you hit V. Well, you can't at the moment because I've got no fuel. But if you hit V, it brings up a tractor and you can do nine tiles at once. Go away. Here, pressing the wrong button. So we'll get these done real quick, get this quest done as quick as we can. Uh, I need to jump back into my carrots, don't I? Yeah, of course I do. Grab them carrots, get them planted real quick. All done. Uh, time to water them. Oh, right mouse button cancels anything that you're doing as well. So like, I went from planting, right right mouse button straight into watering. So we'll get them watered up, get them ready to roll. And also this little wishing well just here gives you 25 coins every two minutes. So you've got a little bit of income coming in. Uh, we've got two apple trees here, a uh, lemon tree, got three lemon trees, ooh that's good, and two more apple trees there, and we have various trees scattered around, I think they're like apple trees and lemon trees and stuff like that. Uh, you also start off with these blue grapes which don't need much just yet, but I'll just water them just to get them done. It's a gradual, gradual game. You, you can easily come on and just take your time and just get things done in your own time. And the decorations, they've, they've got some really nice decorations and you can make your farm look absolutely stunning. Really, really good. There's uh, a photo mode as well, which is absolute plus with me because I hate screenshotting half of the time because when you screenshot you have to edit things out oh it's complicated but with this it's got a nice little photo mode where you can happily photo away and save your photos I'll show you that in a minute once I do this get these carrots out of the way first and as you can see once you water it's gone from 15 minutes to 13 minutes so it takes like 2 minutes off it so that, that's pretty cool. So right, if we go into, uh, oh yeah, if you hit tab, gives you an idea of what you've got. Uh, if you go into the pause menu, so go to escape, photo mode. Look at that. It's awesome. You can move the camera by W, A, S and D. Rotate your camera with your mouse itself. Then zoom out with your right mouse button, zoom in with your left mouse button, press space to hide the interface, so we can just zoom out and photo taken and it gets saved into your file, so that's done and dusted, that's out of the way, uh, what else, as you progress like I said, you, you if I go into the in your menu, well, I might as well talk about this while we're here. You get fences, all different types of fences and props and stuff. Different kind of road surfaces. Uh, 
and also like these are little props they don't do nothing they just sit there and make your your farm look pretty um this is another well i harvest 25 coins every two minutes so you can put a few of them down and you're getting some regular income um again with the vegetable stands you get vegetable stands you get fish stands peanut stand you get all different stands but like this one these uh you sell goods for five diamonds and 20 xp trade is every one minute uh it takes 20 resources and stores up to 40 so that, that's how you get your diamonds together and stuff like that uh as you progress you get like you, you more plants like as a as you can see it's out of season time if you look where plant on it says sun sunshine and ice cubes so in the summer and in the winter you can plant peanuts uh yeah buying for 40 and you harvest you get 65 coins plus 3 xp so your xp xp builds as you go along uh even though it's kept my xp from my other one some of the stuff isn't open Oh no, it's actually XP of the item itself. So, level 2 required for the grapes, I think they are. I think it's because you level up the item as well. You, you'll see what I mean in a second. We'll just quickly walk these. As you can see on the bottom left hand corner where it says carrots, it says level 1. Uh, every time you harvest these, you get so much XP towards that level and that level keeps going up and up and up and up it's not so bad starting off doing this watering and planting and all that it's just when you get start getting big fields and you start thinking oh this is taking forever <coughs> excuse me hence when the tractor comes in the tractor is a lifesaver and you have to fuel it you have a little fuel station uh, I, like I said we'll cover all that as we progress and get more but at the moment there's not much to do at the start it is pretty boring at the start uh, if you jump into your menu as well though if you go to your roads you can buy low grass so like oh no that's an invalid tile of course it is is it there? yep there we go you can get rid of the grass surplus to requirements so you don't just so that you can put more stuff down I suppose I think um, if you keep these tiles as well though you can make fields out of them like if I tap the left mouse button makes a field out of it press X gets rid of the field so it's quite easy quite simple uh, if we run over it quickly uh, if you look into this, this is like the extensions, the farms go on forever. I'll, I think it's just a, an endless map, to be honest. But I need a, a higher XP level for some reason, even though I'm level 11. But never mind, I think I messed up on this game. But no, it don't matter. I might as well quickly water them again. This is a slow and painful thing. But then once you start levelling up, you start getting your quests in left, right and centre. It's just fast paced. And then it'll slow down a bit, when, especially when you've got to do something like something that takes 24 hours or 18 hours, etc. It, it can slow down a bit there, but it's not that bad. You can just obviously jump off then, do what you need to do. And then come back on next day or within a few hours and then you, your harvest done. Uh, you, your fields can die. you got to watch for that as well. So if you leave it too long, then you'll lose it all. But the night time view, it, the game is just beautiful. It's, even though it's cartoony, it's very detailed. Uh, if you press C, you zoom in and out. My little characters all like detailed out little butterflies flying about and everywhere you walk at night it lights up it's just it's just an amazing game i love it absolutely love it these carrots shouldn't be long now we're talking two minutes there oh these are nearly done
music's quite chilling as well. I don't mind the music. Music's quite good. Come on. Like any farm game, it's just playing the waiting game, really. And well, carrots are done. Perfect. Ah, right, let's get these harvest. So we've done nine up to now. See how the levels up, carrot. So then your money goes up as well. For how much you get for it. I think it goes up by one every two levels. I think that's right. I'm not sure though. We'll get these harvest real quick. Get some more down. Cause I think we're gonna need some more. Oh no, we might get away with it. Yeah, we're gonna get away with it. Once these lot are done, then we're laughing. Water and take a few seconds off them. Oh, no, that one. Let's go and grab these while we're here. And we will harvest, not harvest, we'll plow the fields. Get these done, out of the way, get them ready for the next quest. Seven, twenty-eight, thirty. 30 boom now we have to harvest 30 ha apple trees so once I've plowed these it just saves coming back doing it we shall harvest the apple trees oh, is this one that needs harvesting one of 30. No! <laughs> I keep doing that as well, you gotta watch for that. Get ready. Because it's left, left mouse button to uh, collect a harvest of trees, etc. And if you're not directly on it, it digs a bloody field. That's not what you want. This is gonna take a while. I think I'm gonna have to buy some more apple trees. Definitely gonna have to buy some more apple trees. I've leveled up on apple trees. And another one's there. So they take 15 minutes. It's quite a long time for the apple trees. But like I said, you can harvest them all year round, I think. I think you can. Let's grab some more. Yeah, all year round these. That's brilliant. Let's stick one there. One more there. And we'll stick one there. One there. One there. One there. Oh yeah, and you can only plant them on the little tufts, hence why we shouldn't really get rid of them. Is that an apple tree? Right. Uh, hit Z. You move the apple trees as well. Uh, I'm going to have to pop that one there. I'll quickly run over here and grab these apple trees and move them closer. If you hit left shift while you're uh, walking, you'll run as well. Pop you there. Uh, grab you. Come on. Pop you 
lava here. This one. Put that one there. And another apple tree over there. There's them lemon trees. I'll move them in time, I think. I won't move them just yet. Let's get these ones out of the way. get them closer should I say so then we've got easier access on them then don't we boom there we go all trees in place I've got to wait 15 minutes right just let me double check that there's an what quests are going here uh quest lock so yeah we've only got the apple trees to be fair uh tell you what let's plant some some quick I think the lettuces are quite quick, aren't they? Oh, we've got peanuts now. In season for peanuts. It's like 30 minutes, so, but... Yeah, we'll, we'll do some lettuces. That way we can earn a bit of cash while we're waiting. Like I said, it's, it's easy to do a small field without the tractor, but you try doing a big one takes forever especially watering because you start watering then you get to the end of the field and you have to go all the way back again and start again I suppose it keeps you busy if you like that sort of thing but I like to do mine quick and then we'll right mouse button jump into watering straight away 